Jotai is an atomic state management library and it comes with handy utilities to manage large state objects without sacrificing performance. One of them is Siplet Atom Utility. You can Siplet array of objects to get individual atoms and with this approach you will not cause any unnecessary render. Let me show you an example. First, let me show you what the problem is. We have two separate components here and one of them is built with use state hook and one of them with Jotai. You can consider each tile as a separate component in your app and you can think like we have a large state object to manage our components tree like this. And each tile has its selected value. When we click any of the tile, this value is changing. And also the color is changing based on its selected value. At the first glance, you can say like, you can think like they are both same. But when we check with React DevTools, we will see that they are not same. Let me show you. When we click the use state one, we will see that it re-renders all of the tiles again and again, like this. But when we click the Jotai's one, it only re-renders the tile that we click. So let me show you how we can create this component with Jotai's Siplet Atom. Okay, first things first, let's check the use state version and understand how it works. We have tiles component here and in tiles component we have a state like this. We map through these items and for each tile we are returning a tile component and we pass our tile state as well as the setter function for the state. Let's check the tile component. The tile component has a on click callback function. In this function, we are setting a selected value for the tile that we click. If it's not the tile that we click, we simply return the tile again. So how can we build this with Jotai Siplet Atom? To create this component with Jotai, we first need to install Jotai Utilities Library. We can check their website and in this receive section, there is large objects page. And if you click this page, you will see Siplet Atom. This is the atom that we are going to use in our project. To install this utility, we can simply write yarn add Jotai utils like this. And it's done. To create this component with Jotai, we can create another folder called tiles with Adam like this. And also we can copy this component that we have created with use state and paste into this new folder. In this folder, we can just comment out this for a while and remove this. We can copy this initial state, right? And get rid of this use state hook. First, we need to create our base atom like this, const tiles atom equals atom and we will pass our initial value like this and I want to pass our tile type like this okay cool then we need to split this array of objects with 
sip it Adam like this comes split it tars Adam equals siplet Adam tars Adam okay we need to import this function from Jotai's utility import siplet Adam from Jotai utils like this okay now we need to read this Adam value like this const sip tiles equals use Adam value and sip it tiles Adam like this and again we need to import this from Jotai and we can simply map through these tiles and pass our atom into this component like this because in this splitted tiles atom each object is an atom so this tile is an atom then we can pass this atom into our tile component as prop right and also for the key prop we can use tile to string function this is gonna be unique for each atom and we don't need any tile prop anymore but we need to fix this error for the tile component that's why we need to create another component for our new tile right okay so we can copy this tile into this folder and in this new component we don't need tile or setter function anymore we only need atom like this right and this is gonna be primitive atom type with tile interface okay cool now we need to read the value of this atom in the component like this comes tile and setter equals use atom and we will pass our atom into this hook so we need to change our setter function at the moment because we don't have the other tiles anymore we only have the individual tile at the moment so we can change this like return and we will spread the previous value and we will change is selected value with the old is selected value okay cool now we have an error here because we need to import this tile right like this okay cool now we need to change the name of this component because there is also another tiles component and i don't want to get error because of this so tiles with atom like this okay cool now we can import this new component into our page like this tiles tiles with atom and we need to change the name jotai use sorry siplet adam version okay cool if we click it we can see that it works and also we can check with react dev tools if it cause any unnecessary render so if we click this it re-renders all the tiles but if we 
click this, it only will render the tile that we click. Okie dokie, we are done. If you enjoy this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel to get videos like this.